The nominees for the Gold Logie this year are Roger Corsa, Grant Tenya, Amanda Keller, Tracy Grimshaw, Andrew Winter, and Jessica Murray. It's finally here. Oh my God, it's Grant Denya. Game shows aren't important, um, but this is so important to me. Um, thank you so much. Wow, I can't believe this. Um, I wasn't expecting to stand up here tonight. I, I, I definitely thought it was Amanda Keller's um, night tonight. She's a remarkable human being. I've had the pleasure of spending all week with her. And <laughs> she's taught me so much about being a decent human being uh, and enjoying a moment and making the most of life. And she's had an incredible career. She's been doing it longer and, and better than I have. So Amanda, thank you so much for this wonderful week that we've had together. Oh my Lord. Um, wow, obviously the power of people has been pretty extraordinary this week with everybody rallying behind Family Feud as we say goodbye to this show. This show has been incredible for me in my life. The last four years have been truly magnificent. Um, Tom Gleeson, where are you? Yeah, you're over there. Yeah, thanks for the hard chat, mate. I appreciate it. Sometimes if you need to get some things done in this country, you need a angry redhead and Pauline Hanson wasn't available, so I had you, mate. Thank you so much. <laughs> um, wow. It really is a, um, an absolute honour to be welcomed into your, your lounge rooms and your households every single night and I certainly don't take that for granted. It's been a blessing to be in there six nights a week. I've truly enjoyed the fact that um, we've kind of made a television show Family Feud for the last couple of years that has brought families together. Um, I particularly take a lot of joy out of the fact that families still sit down on the one couch together and consume Family Feud and watch it as a family, kids, adults, grandparents and that is something I'm very proud of because that's a very traditional kind of form of television and some of my favourite memories from growing up as a kid. I was really lucky in television to get a break from a bloke called Doug Hogan in, in prime television, Wagga Wagga, and I couldn't spell, I couldn't write. Um, all I could do is work in my school holidays and wash news cars and carry tripods around and hope that one day I might have a job in television. So he gave a young bloke a go and I'll forever be thankful to Doug Hogan for doing that. So thank you so much. To my parents for supporting me, for my mum, uh, she's amazing, she gave me my sense of humour, my dad gave me my attention to detail and my focus and work ethic, so I, I thank them so much. Um, look, I'll, t I'll tell you why this is important to me tonight, and it really is a very, very special achievement, because um, Family Feud came along for me in my life at a time when I, I really wasn't quite sure if I'd ever work again, or if I even wanted to. Um, I wasn't particularly in a, in a very good place. Um, I wasn't very well. I was in a bit of a hole. I was pretty sad. I was a bit lost. And Family Feud came along and I was... In fact, I was very unwell. I was very unwell at that particular time. And Family Feud gave me a ladder out of that hole. And I'm very lucky to have had it. It gave me my mojo back. It gave me my confidence. It gave me some courage. I rebuilt myself. It gave me a new attitude. And I figured out it's never too late to improve yourself, to be kind to other people, 
and to know that you can always be a better you and you can have a much better positive influence on other people. So family few, thank you so much, you saved me. It's just television, and I know it's just entertainment, but it, it means the world to me. Depan Barnes, who's run the most incredible t television team in the country, thank you so much. I love you dearly. You're the best in the country. I know there's a room full of people working behind the scenes now uh, who, are, who are camped down in Melbourne who are just, their heads have exploded right now with excitement. You are the nicest human beings I've ever worked with, and you've created the most magic experience for every single person that came on Family Feud for four years. That's 5,000 people and you made their lives. Um, to my beautiful wife, Shezzy. <laughs> oh my God, we did it, Dallas. <laughs> we bloody did it. <laughs> Holy crap. Um, wow, we've come a long way. <laughs> um, I owe this to you. We are an incredible team and you <laughs> And you've been there by my side through the best and the worst. And we've had some down times and we've had some great times. And I want you to share in this moment because this is yours as much as it is mine. You've been there and you've held me up when it wasn't so great. You believed in me even when I stopped believing in myself. But you never changed your attitude. You're always a ray of sunshine in our world. And you've made the two most beautiful girls that I could have ever imagined, Sailor and Scout at home. So thank you for everything. This is yours. I dedicate it to you. I, to Channel 10, thank you so much. It's been the most incredible opportunity. I really appreciate you asking me on this. You said, make it your own, have some fun, and that's exactly what we did. And it has been, I think, probably the greatest experience of my life. So to Paul Anderson, thank you so much from Channel 10. Beverly McGarvey, you're my absolute hero. You're a fun chick, and we've made some great telly together, and I hope we continue to make plenty more. We've got Game of Games coming. It's going to be epic. Uh, to everybody at 10 and Fremantle, thank you so much. Um, I've said survey says 30,000 times <laughs> over the last four years. So if it's okay, as we bow out Family Feud for the final time, before I do that, thank you everybody around Australia for voting for this. This is absolutely incredible. I can't believe the groundswell of support. You have blown my mind. But for the very last time, Survey Says, thank you so much for making this your top answer. I really appreciate it. God love you, everybody. Thank you so much.